nature provides humanity in particular with a lot of services. Essentially, nature has a provisioning aspect. We get food, fiber, fuel. Um, it also has a regulating aspect when nature is functioning properly. And that regulation is regulation of water, regulation of atmosphere. And by regulation of water, we mean we, we would like water to fall, soak into the ground, grow plants, recharge our groundwater, recharge springs and streams. These are all examples of hydrological regulation. Um, regulation of atmosphere, healthy soil, holding significant amounts of carbon that used to be in the atmosphere and that now resides in the soil. It is cyclical and we can't think of sequestration, oh we lock it there in perpetuity. No, this is a cycle and we can influence the stocks and the pools through our management and the residents' times. These are all services that nature provides, but there's so much interface and reliance with human management. If nature's working, and, and she is working, she's working really hard all the time. It's quiet and we don't know what's happening necessarily, but like someone rolling a boulder up a hill, we see that and we know, some, oh, he's doing a lot of work right there. But nature's doing that silently right now all around us with these plants growing and the plants growing and the microbiology and the soil working and the raindrops hitting the soil that is in a condition created by those microbes and those plants um, and doing what it does. So the environmental services that we're talking about are critical to economics. I mean, there, there is a basic insight here and that is that all economics really does start with photosynthesis. Whether we're talking about coal and oil whether we're talking about flood regulation, whether we're talking about food production, or gold for that matter. I mean, gold is one of those elements that's concentrated by microbes way back in time. So even that gold that we tend to think of as a piece of a rock that came from somewhere, at some point, the sunlight drove a process that ended up in that gold kind of stacking up somewhere. So environmental services or ecosystem services are essentially what comes from nature that makes life not only possible but good.